Hello guys welcome back to our anime explainer. Guys please like the video and subscribe to my channel thank you. Today is explanation of upcoming episode of Battle Through the Heavens based on novel. So let's start. What are the two of you doing? Xiaoyang by the side similarly experienced a change in expression due to the sudden battle between the little fairy doctor and Zun Er. He hurriedly extended his hand over. When he was about to forcefully pull the two ladies apart, the jade-like hands, that had been together, gently withdrew. The grey-coloured Do Chi flow and the golden-coloured flame swiftly scattered. I have long heard that little fairy Dr. Jie Jie's, older sister, woeful poison body, is really strong. It really lives up to its reputation now that we have met. However, thank you for taking care of Xiaoyang Ji Ji. During this period of time, Zana gently took a step back, rubbed her hand mildly, and spoke with a slight smile. I have also heard Xiaoyang mentioning you many times. Now that we have met, you are indeed a lady blessed by the heavens. No wonder you are constantly on his mind. The little fairy doctor replied with a warm smile. Although these two ladies appeared exceptionally warm when they spoke, Xiaoyang could sense an unusualness within their voices. He bitterly laughed in his heart. These two ladies had the capital to be proud. One had a natural poison constitution, while the other possessed the bloodline of an ancient Do Di. Now that they had met, there was a vague feeling of the both of them refusing to give in to the other. Could this be the opposition between two outstanding ladies? All right, this matter is over. Let's all rest for a while. Moreover, this is not a good place to chat. Xiaoyang shook his head and helplessly spoke. Zun Er and the little fairy doctor nodded slightly upon hearing his words. Seeing them nod, Xiaoyang took the lead to move his body and land in the Yi clan manor in the center of the city. Zun er's group followed close behind as a countless number of gazes watched them. The entire Yi city also began to turn into an uproar after Xiaoyang's group rushed down. The soul-stirring battle today would likely spread throughout the central plains like the wind, Yi Zhong and all the clan members of the Yi clan hurriedly stepped forward after Xiao Yang's group landed in the Yi clan manor. After today's shocking battle, Yi Zhong had finally witnessed Xiao Yang's ability. Even a faction as strong as the Ice River Valley was forced back in a dispirited fashion, despite having sent out all of their strongest people. From this, one could tell just how strong Xiao Yang was. Although he clearly understood that most of this was due to the sudden arrival of reinforcements, he also understood that being able to summon these reinforcements was part of Xiao Yang's repertoire, Big Brother Xiao Yang. Are you alright? Xin Lan's face was filled with joy when she saw that Xiao Yang was fine. Xiao Yang smiled and nodded. He pointed at Zun Er and said to Xin Lan. This is Zun Er, I think that you should have also heard of her, he he, one of the founders of Pan's Gate. Senior Zun Er. Being a member of Pan's Gate, how can I have never heard of her? Xin Lan covered her mouth and saucily laughed. Zun Er was also startled when she heard her reply. Her elegant face immediately revealed a gentle smile that caused the hearts of those young people from the Yi clan to rapidly beat, as she softly said, Cuckoo. So you are also a student from the Inner Academy, Elder Yi Zhong. Can you please arrange a place for us to chat? Xiao Yang grinned and turned to Yi Zhong. Mr. Xiao Yang really knows how to joke. Such a small matter is naturally not a problem. Yi Zhong hurriedly nodded upon hearing his request. He personally lead the way at the front. Xiao Yang smiled. He led Sun Er, the little fairy doctor, and the rest followed. Xiao Yang Ji Ji, what are your subsequent plans? Zun Er pushed the teacup beside her to Xiao Yang as she inquired with a gentle voice. I need to rescue teacher from the hands of the Hall of Souls. The strength of Xiao Yang's hand holding the teacup involuntarily increased. A chill flashed across his dark black eyes. Xiao Yang Ji Ji's teacher should be Yao Zunzhe, Yao Chen, from back then, right? Zun Er was not surprised at Xiao Yang's answer as she softly inquired. She had done some research after having returned to the Ji Yu clan. Hence, it was not surprising that she was aware of Yao Lao's identity. Xiao Yang slightly nodded, Yao Chen. The black-clothed, old man by the side was slightly astounded when he heard that name. Immediately, his eyes glanced at Xiao Yang in surprise. He said, it is unexpected that he is your teacher, that old fellow's medicinal refining skills are something that hardly anyone on this Do Chi continent can match, that's right. Back then, we had also met Yao Chen a couple of times. However, the both of us were merely ordinary Do Zongs at that time, the other white-haired, old man also laughed and let out a sigh full of emotions. 
Xiao Yang grinned. His eyes turned to Zun'er, who was in deep thought, as he asked, What is it? The Hall of Souls will definitely take precautions against you after the matter today. They might even shift the place where they have imprisoned Mr. Yao Chen. If you were to boldly head there, it is likely that you will only deliver yourself to their hands. Zana hesitated for a moment and replied, You should not underestimate this Hall of Souls. My Giyu clan has exchanged blows with them many times over the years. However, we have not hurt their core. With your strength, even if you have these two Dozuns by your side, it is likely very difficult to rescue Yao Chen from the hands of the Hall of Souls if you do not plan properly. The white-haired, old man also reminded. Young Miss cannot stay for too long this time around. She must return in at the very most ten days. Your status is a little unique to our GU clan. Before you possess the ability to protect yourself, the old me feels that it is best that you do not make contact with the GU clan, Xiao Yang gently knit his brows. Although he was uncertain just what unique meant, he was aware that there was some relationship between the Jiu clan and the Xiao clan. Moreover, the Chushi ancient gods jade on him was something that the Jiu clan wanted to obtain. Yao Lao had reminded him back, and that it was best not to leak word about it. Otherwise, it would definitely attract a fatal disaster. Due to this point, Xiao Yang would be careful when making contact with the Jiu clan. Xiao Yang Ji Ji, the strength of the Hall of Souls is far more than what you have seen. Therefore, you must not be careless. The matter of rescuing Mr. Yao Lao and Uncle Xiao all relies on you. Zunna's expression was a little grave. She was afraid that Xiao Yang would head to rescue Yao Lao now in his recklessness and end up landing in the hands of the Hall of Souls. After all, the true intention of the Hall of Souls was the Chu Shi ancient god's jade in Xiao Yang's hands. Zunna sighed in relief within her heart when she heard his words. She said, Xiao Yang Ji Ji, please rest assured. Mr. Yao Chen is not an ordinary Do Zun. The Hall of Souls will not take his life so easily. Once I return, I will use the strength of the Ji Yu clan to find the location where Yao Chen is imprisoned. If I receive any news, I will immediately dispatch someone to inform you. Xiao Yang slightly nodded. Since this moment was not the best time to rescue Yao Lao, he would need to prepare for the matter of the Pill Tower's pill gathering. If he was able to obtain the 3,000 burning flames, his strength was bound to soar. At that time, he would be able to fight against experts at being his level. Once that occurred, he would quietly gather helpers and rescue Yao Lao from the hands of the Hall of Souls in one attempt. As for his father Xiao Zhan, Xiao Yang's eyes became slightly dim when he thought of his father. Ever since Xiao Zhan had disappeared back then, there had not been any news of him. If not for the soul light spot on the Chu Shi ancient gods, Jade still existing, it was likely that even Xiao Yang would have thought that Xiao Zhan had been killed by the Hall of Souls. Perhaps I might be able to obtain some news relating to father from Qing Hai's mouth, Xiao Yang's finger rubbed the ring on his finger. A dense expression suddenly flashed across his eyes. Being an honorable elder of the Hall of Souls, it was likely that Qing Hai was aware of many things, however, regardless of whether it is rescuing Yao Lao or father, all of that is based on the precondition of me possessing sufficient strength. Hence, 3000 Burning Flame. I will obtain you. Xiao Yang was seated cross legged in a guest room deep within the Yi clan manor. Both of his hands had formed a training seal. There was a heated aura vaguely lingering around him as he inhaled and exhaled. Although Xiao Yang did not suffer an overly serious injury from the big battle during the day, his Dou Qi had basically been exhausted. Moreover, the overbearing energy that had been created when using the Skyfire 3 mysterious change had also caused some damage to his body. If he didn't have a strong physical body, it was likely that some of his veins would have burst apart because of the overbearing energy. Wave after wave of natural energy slowly entered Xiao Yang's body. After undergoing a refinement, they transformed into clusters of Dou Qi that flowed through his veins. This caused the faint feeling of pain emitted from his veins to gradually reduce, this quiet training lasted for two to three hours before Xiao Yang slowly opened his tightly shut eyes. His pale white face had recovered a sleek redness. The exhausted Dou Qi within his body had become much fuller after some recuperation, my strength is still insufficient. With my current strength, I can at the very most deal with experts at the peak of the Dou Zone class. As for Dou Zone class experts, unless I use the final extermination lotus flame, it is likely that I will have difficulty harming them, Xiao Yang opened his eyes, sensed the condition within his body, and sighed in relief. After which, 
he immediately mused to himself in his heart. There were a little too many experts, who had appeared in the big battle today. This allowed Xiao Yang to truly understand his strength. In the central plains, one must rely on one's fist to speak. If Zun A had not arrived in time today, it was likely that the fate of his group would not have been good. However, if he possessed enough strength, to the point where he need not fear the valley chief of the Ice River Valley, he would naturally be able to rely on himself to resolve such a situation, instead of relying on his luck and waiting for others to aid him, Zuna was able to rescue him once, but what about the second time, or the third, or the fourth? Although the strength of the Ju clan behind Zun A was very strong, Xiao Yang was also quite afraid of this Ju clan. He was uncertain just what kind of relationship the Xiao clan had with the Ju clan back then. The other party's intention was very clear. They also wanted to obtain the Chiu Shi ancient god's jade from Xiao Yang. Of course, they were different from the Hall of Souls in that they used gentle tactics, while the Hall of Souls used all means at their disposal, whether fair or foul. The matter of Zun are intervening to rescue him, would likely reach the ears of the Ju clan very soon. Xiao Yang was uncertain what their attitude toward him would be. However, one needed to think of the worst scenario if anything happened. If this Ju clan were to attack him one day in an attempt to snatch the Chu Shi ancient god's jade, he needed to be in possession of a strength that belonged to him. Xiao Yang believed that even if the Ju clan were opposing him, Zun A would not attack him. This point could be proven by the fact that the Ju clan was still unaware that the Chu Shi ancient god's jade was with him even now. Since Zun A was able to keep such an important matter a secret, it was possible for him to tell where he was within her heart. Of course, if this were to really happen, it was likely that Zuna would descend into a swirl between love and kin. At that time, she would suffer regardless of who was victorious. This was also something that Xiao Yang did not wish to say, no matter how I put it, it all boils down to me not being strong enough. If I possess sufficient strength, even the Ju clan would not forcefully attack me, Xiao Yang softly sighed. His fist suddenly tightened. With each advancement of a star, he was able to sense that strength was the most important thing. Family, love, clan, etc., all these things could only be protected with sufficient strength. Zuna's face revealed embarrassment that an outsider would never see after her hand was grabbed by Xiao Yang. However, she did not free her hand. After being separated from Xiao Yang for so many years, her feelings had not only not faded, but had become warmer, like the accumulated sediment following the flow of time, spreading to every part of her body. Zuna shifted her feet and sat by the side of the bed. Her face gently leaned against Xiao Yang's broad shoulders, as she softly muttered, Xiao Yang ji ji, Zana has really missed you all these years, hearing the feelings of attachment in the lady's words would shock any outsider who heard them. Xiao Yang felt a warmth in his heart. His arm rolled down, and he hugged Zana's delicate and soft waist. After which, he buried his head into her smooth, black hair, and sniffed the faint fragrance. The slight frustration within his heart seemed to vanish at this moment. Zuna allowed Xiao Yang to hug her. A moment later, she finally raised her head. Her intelligent eyes of her looked at Xiao Yang's face as she flipped her hand. A golden-colored scroll appeared in it, and she handed the scroll to Xiao Yang. This is the last three seals of the God Seal skill. With Xiao Yang Gege's current strength, you should be able to practice the third seal, Zuna softly said. Xiao Yang Gege should not reject it. The Central Plains is not the Black Corner region. There are as many experts as there are clouds here. One would be safer if one has more skills to preserve one's life. Zun A cannot continue to remain here. Therefore, you cannot find an excuse to reject this god seal skill. Xiao Yang was startled when he saw the glittering, golden scroll. He felt some helplessness. This girl seems to be always thinking of pushing her things on him. Xiao Yang hesitated a little in the face of Zun A's eyes. However, he did not put up much of a resistance, and he soon took the scroll. He was interested in this god seal skill. Moreover, Zun A was right. If one did not have sufficient skills when roaming the central plains, it was likely that one would be less safe. Xiao Yang had also long since experienced the might of the god seal skill. The open mountain seal and sea flipping seal could be considered strong killing moves when he was at the Dou Wang and Dou Huang class. Following Xiao Yang's advancement to the Dou Zone class, the might of these two seals was much weaker. If he wanted to raise his strength, he would naturally need to practice the remaining training methods for the god seal skill, a smile surfaced on Zuna's face when she saw Xiao Yang accept the scroll. 
The current Xiao Yang no longer possessed the kind of insolent sharpness that he had back then. Instead, he was a lot more matured and restrained. That's right, Xiao Yang Ji Ji. You did not allow anyone else know about the matter of the Chu Shi ancient gods Jade, did you? Zana appeared to have recalled something as she suddenly asked in a serious voice. That's right, Xiao Yang trailed off. This thing had far too great of an implication. He naturally did not dare to inform anyone about it. Even the little fairy doctor, Qian Zunzhe, and the others did not know about the existence of the Chu Shi ancient gods Jade. Zana finally sighed in relief upon hearing him, this Chu Shi ancient gods Jade, is it something that the Ji Yu clan wished to obtain? Xiao Yang frowned slightly and asked. The Chu Shi ancient god is the last Dou Di that has appeared on the Dou Qi continent that we know of. He left behind a Dou Di mansion hidden within empty space. This Dou Di mansion is well preserved. My Ji Yu clan and the Hall of Souls are thinking of entering it. The Chu Shi ancient god's jade is the key to opening that Dou Di mansion, Xiao Yang's expression became increasingly more solemn upon hearing Zunna's words. It was indeed as Yao Lao had said. The implication of the Chu Shi ancient god's jade was indeed too great. Dou Di, this was a form to address the ruler of this world. The value of anything even the least bit related to this name would soar. This point was something that could be identified from just watching the Giyu clan. The blood of a Dou Di flowed in the bodies of the members of the Giyu clan. This had resulted in the current position of the Giyu clan on the Dou Qi continent. Although no one dared call it unique, it could definitely be considered among the peak, therefore, before Xiaoyang Ji Ji has absolute strength, you must not expose the Chu Shi ancient gods jade in your hands. Zana's expression was unusually grave when she spoke. The current Xiao clan had declined. Even though the ancestors of the Jiu clan and the Xiao clan had an agreement, there was currently a great difference in opinion in the Jiu clan regarding this matter. If this matter were exposed, it was difficult to be certain that some experts in the Jiu clan would not privately do something. At that time, Xiao Yang would be in danger. Xiao Yang slowly nodded as he studied Zun as grave expression. He softly said, the reason the Hall of Souls captured my father is also due to this. Zana gently nodded and replied, the Xiao clan could once be considered a top-tier faction on the Dou Qi continent. At that time, the strength of the Xiao clan was something that even the Ice River Valley had difficulty comparing with, surprise flashed across Xiao Yang's eyes when he heard her. He had never expected the Xiao clan have once been brilliant, unfortunately, following the flow of time, the Xiao clan gradually declined. After which, some of the ancestors of the Xiao clan could only leave the Central Plains and finally settle down in the Jiuma Empire, Zana softly explained, following the decline over these generations, other than a few members of the Xiao clan, everyone else, including the younger generation, is unaware, Xiao Yang slightly nodded. By being able to develop the Xiao clan to that extent, it is likely that the ancestor of the Xiao clan back then was someone with extraordinary strength, Kuku, that ancestor of the Xiao clan, was indeed an absolutely brilliant person. Within a short few hundred years, he stood at the peak of the continent. There were only four people on the entire continent who were a match for him, Zana smiled as she told Xiao Yang more. She appeared to be aware of what Xiao Yang was thinking after watching his expression. Even though Xiao Yang was already prepared, he still could not help but feel stunned when he heard her words. There was only four people in this vast continent who could compare with him. This achievement was indeed shocking, it is unexpected that this ancestor possessed such an achievement, Xiao Yang felt as though his blood was boiling by just imagining this. The talent of that ancestor is something that even the Jiu clan greatly admires. Under his leadership, the relationship between the Xiao clan and the Jiu clan were very good at that time. This alliance agreement was also formed at that time, Zana smiled as she added more. Alliance agreement. That ancestor of the Xiao clan once did the Jiu clan a favor. When he was about to die, he impeached the Jiu clan to take care of the Xiao clan and preserve the bloodline of the Xiao clan at any critical moments, this alliance agreement was quite effective for a short time after he died. However, with the flow of time and the Xiao clan's disappearance from the central plains, this alliance agreement gradually lost its effect, Zana looked at Xiao Yang and said, one of the reason I went to the Xiao clan back then was because father wished for me to have a quiet childhood. The other is that some people in the clan wanted me to take the Xiao clan's Chu Shi ancient gods Jade, he is my ancestor. I am his descendant. How will it look if I don't even know the name of his elderly self? Xiao Yang rolled his eyes as he replied. Zana slightly smiled and softly replied, 
that ancestor of the Xiao clan is called Xiao Xian, Xiao Xian. Xiao Yang repeated this name in his mouth before laughing, he is indeed worthy of being an ancestor of the Xiao clan. His name is really domineering, Zana rolled her eyes at Xiao Yang. Her enchanting manner caused him to stare at her without diverting his eyes. After having not seen this girl for a couple of years, it appeared that her appeal was growing. Her frown and smile were all filled with a natural charm that was difficult to hide. The ancient tomb of Xiao Xian is in the Jiu realm. However, that ancient tomb possesses a mysterious strength. Those from the Jiu clan cannot enter it. Although some of those with extremely powerful strength within the Jiu clan could forcefully enter it, they did not dare to randomly barge in, especially since this Xiao Xian ultimately did the Jiu clan a favor. Therefore, no one has been able to enter this ancient tomb after so many years. Zana eyes wandered when she spoke until this point. She looked at Xiao Yang and voiced her thoughts, if I have guessed correctly, it is likely that only you, a member of the Xiao clan, can enter it. If you have the opportunity to head to the Jiu realm, you might perhaps go and take a look. You could end up gaining something there, the factions in the Central Plains region cannot be summarized by the face one hall, one tower, two sects, three valleys, four pavilions. The Central Plains region is incomparably vast. There are quite a number of hidden factions. For example, my GU clan is not ranked among them, but would anyone who has some knowledge dare to say that the GU clan cannot make it? Zana helplessly shook her head and continued, some of the factions in the Central Plains regions that keep a low profile might quietly possess a strength that is not weaker than these ranked factions. After all, there will always be some old demons who do not show themselves behind them. Even the Ice River Valley does not only possess this strength that you can see on the surface, Xiao Yang rubbed his head, feeling a little speechless. This was indeed worthy of being the Central Plains region. It did live up to the phrase hidden dragons and tigers. Xiao Yang GEGE, Zana will not be able to stay long during this trip. Otherwise, I would bring you a lot of trouble. You will have to rely on yourself for everything after I leave. Hence, you must not be reckless, Zana gently rubbed Xiao Yang's face and worried about him. Upon hearing that Zan A was about to leave, Xiao Yang involuntarily tightened the grip of the hand he used to hug her narrow waist. His eyes stared intently at this lovely face in front of him as he asked, When can I head to the Jiu realm to look for you? Zan A involuntarily lifted the corner of her lips into a sweet arc when she heard his question. She replied, As long as you have confidence in yourself, you can come anytime you like. No matter what happens, all Xiao Yang Ji Ji needs to know is that Zana will stand on your side. Xiao Yang slowly nodded upon hearing her words. He tightly hugged Zan Er and softly said, Relax. I know just how many challenges and how much trouble I will face when I head to the Ji realm. I will not be reckless, because I want them to know that your eyesight is the best. Xiao Yang stared intently at Zan Er. A fiery heat had involuntarily surfaced in his eyes. His hand, holding Zana's waist, involuntarily moved. After which, it broke through her clothes and touched her jade-like, warm, smooth, Zana's face immediately turned fiery hot, as she sensed Xiao Yang's hand creating a mischief. However, a fog seemed to be ripping through her autumn water eyes at this moment. There was a dryness in Xiao Yang's mouth as his throat rolled a little. The nefarious flame in his lower abdomen earlier had suddenly surged, causing a lustful flame to materialize in his eyes, Zana's face became more and more crimson with embarrassment, as she sensed the change in Xiao Yang. Due to the slowly moving hand of Xiao Yang on her waist, she let out a slight moan, this slight moan was just like a demonic sound that caused Xiao Yang's heart to suddenly beat even faster. He finally could not control himself as he embraced this lovely figure. As his hands moved up and down, he also kissed her alluring little mouth, the two lips made contact. That gentle creamy feeling suddenly caused both of their bodies to become fiery hot at this moment. Xiao Yang's body was stiff for an instant before it was enveloped by an even denser, more lustful flame. He took the opportunity presented by Zun a stiff body to force his tongue in. He was just like a bandit that was plundering wantonly. Zun a was similarly shocked by Xiao Yang's boldness, until her mind became much blurrier. Only after Xiao Yang had barged in did she reflexively began to struggle. However, the current her appeared exceptionally weak. Her frightening strength, where her punch could penetrate space itself, seemed to have completely disappeared at this moment. The lustful flame burned within Xiao Yang's chest. His roaming hand around Zun as waist involuntarily climbed. A moment later, it finally touched a softness that caused one to brace one's attention, 
the soft touch was just like a spark that lit the fuse of some explosive. Xiao Yang's hand quietly undid her green clothes, revealing her snow-like skin. Young miss, the old me has something to discuss with you. A dry elderly cough suddenly sounded outside of the door, just when Xiao Yang was about to gradually peel everything off of the person in his embrace. The elderly voice was clearly transmitted into the room. This elderly voice contained a powerful Dou Qi that seemed to explode beside Xiao Yang's and Zunna's ears, suddenly waking the both of them from a state of being lost in passion. After recovering her clear head, Zunna saw the extremely intimate posture of the two of them and the clothes that had already been half stripped from her, revealing her snow-white skin underneath. Her face immediately turned so red that it appeared as though blood was about to drip from it. A pair of dark eyes stared angrily at Xiao Yang in her embarrassment. She extended her hand and pulled the blanket over, wrapping it tightly around her body as she did so. Xiao Yang also recovered his mind at this moment. He helplessly spread his hands as he looked at Zun as embarrassed anger. After which, he awkwardly said, That's it is not my fault, Ua, no. Ua, Xiao Yang tried to defend himself before eventually lowering his head, dispirited. He did not expect his self-control to be this poor in front of Zunna. Zunna's lovely and enchanting face involuntarily revealed a smile when she saw the dispirited Xiao Yang lowering his head. However, this smile was quickly withdrawn by her. Her body hid under the blanket as she hurriedly put on her clothes amid a trudging sound. After which, she softly said, You rascal, you are actually having such crooked thoughts, Xiao Yang raised his head. He moved his lips and muttered with a helpless face, What can I do against Zunna's allure, but a moment ago, don't say it. Zunna's face once again turned red. She hurriedly extended her hand and blocked Xiao Yang's mouth. However, he ended up grabbing her hand instead. She thought that Xiao Yang was about to do something bad again, when she saw a love that could not be hidden in his dark black eyes. Zunna felt her head explode when she spoke. Even she could not imagine that she would utter those words. Immediately, she ceased saying anything else to Xiao Yang. Her body moved and she rushed out of the room. Xiao Yang gently clenched his hand as he studied Zunna's figure. The creaminess from earlier seemed to have remained, this old fellow interrupted something good. How inconsiderate, while Xiao Yang was quietly muttering under his breath, the two black-clothed, old men outside the room were walking up and down just like ants in a hot pot. Their eyes appeared a little red. They had been protecting Zun uh, all this while and had naturally discovered that she had suddenly come to Xiao Yang's room earlier. They did not think much of it, but following the flow of time, they seemed to have sensed something amiss. Xiao Yang and Zun uh, were both young. Now that they had reunited, they were just like dry wood in a strong flame, igniting upon contact, if they were an ordinary man and woman, it was fine if they ignited. The two of them would definitely not do something this inconsiderate. However, Zun -a was not an ordinary lady. She was the person with the most perfect bloodline in the Jiu clan within the last thousand years. If she were to hand her body to Xiao Yang today, Xiao Yang would definitely be chased to the ends of the world by the furious Jiu clan. At that time, the two of them would also face the offense of not properly protecting Zun -a. Their fates would not be any better than Xiao Yang's fate. All of this was because Zun -a was really too important to the Jiu clan. The two of them continued walking back and forth in front of the entrance. A moment later, they suddenly came to a halt. Their eyes looked at each other and saw the red eyes of the other party. Finally, they nodded. They suddenly turned their bodies and forcefully pushed the door. Creak, their hands were about to make contact with the door when the door was suddenly opened. Zunna's figure appeared in front of the two of them, young miss. The two black-clothed, old men were a little agitated when they saw Zunna coming out. Their old eyes contained an impulse to cry. If this young man and woman were a little impulsive, it was likely that the entire Jiu clan would become crazy, seeing the appearance of these two, Zunna's face, forcefully maintaining a cold and indifferent look, involuntarily reddened a little. However, her voice appeared exceptionally calm, Old Lin, what are the both of you doing? The corner of the white-haired, old man's mouth slightly twitched. He immediately asked with a faltering voice. Young miss, you and Xiao Yang didn't do anything, right, what nonsense are the both of you thinking? Xiao Yang softly sighed and inhaled a deep breath of air, gradually calming his mind in the process. After gradually calming his mind, the golden-colored scroll that Sun had given him appeared in his hand. Inside it was the last three seals of the God Seal skill. Xiao Yang was extremely interested in this God Seal skill. Based on what was recorded on it, 
if he mastered all five seals, its strength would be comparable to that of a Qian class Dou technique. Xiao Yang was unclear about the might of a Qian class Dou technique. However, he was able to obtain some clues from the five ring flame expelling technique. With the help of this Dou technique, he had used his own strength to defeat Qian Shi and Bing Xian, the expert trio from the Ice River Valley. The result of the battle was indeed glorious. Xiao Yang held the golden colored scroll and played with it a little. After musing, he did not immediately begin to practice it. Instead, he returned it to his storage ring. After his conversation with Zun Er, Xiao Yang had gained a more complete understanding of the importance of strength. A Dou technique can be practiced any time. Raising my strength is the most important thing. Xiao Yang's expression gradually turned grave. His hand suddenly pulled apart his clothes, revealing the black-colored vortex of the demon poison spot. In the past, he had been afraid that the swift increase in his strength would result in his foundation being unstable. However, after using the Skyfire 3 mysterious change, Xiao Yang gained some control of the strength of energy on higher levels. Hence, it was time to completely resolve this demon poison spot. With Xiao Yang's current strength, it was no longer difficult for him to completely refine the demon poison spot. With the capacity of Xiao Yang's body, it should be possible for it to completely absorb the enormous amount of pure Dou Qi contained within it. In other words, resolving this demon poison spot that had troubled Xiao Yang for many years was a matter of course, he he, Xia Bai Yang, I shall now unceremoniously accept the great gift you gave me back then. Xiao Yang's hand gently rubbed the demon poison spot on his chest. A cold smile surfaced on the corner of his mouth. He swiftly crossed his legs and sat down. With a change of the seal formed by his hands, the jade green flame within his body furiously began to burn. After which, it wildly charged to the location of the demon poison spot. The interior of the demon poison spot contained all of the Dou Qi of Xie Bai Yang. Back then, Xie Bai Yang had been a two to three star Dou Zong no matter how one put it. Although the current demon poison spot was no longer complete, Xiao Yang's strength would definitely soar if he could successfully refine all of it. This situation was something that Xiao Yang was happy to see. The current him needed sufficient strength. Without strength, everything was just unrealistic plans and empty talk. The jade green flame turned into a storm within Xiao Yang's body with just a thought from his mind. After which, it gathered around the demon poison spot. The high temperature caused the poison to wiggle continuously. Wave after wave of faint black fog spread out, currently, the demon poison spot had already lost its qualification to act fearlessly within Xiao Yang's body like it did in the past. Back then, it was able to completely ignore the glazed lotus heart flame. However, with the increase in Xiao Yang's strength, the little fire seedling back then had turned into a large being. The demon poison spot appeared, just like a herd of goats that had been targeted by a pack of wolves when the jade green flame that surrounded it. It felt as though it was trembling. It was able to sense that its good days had come to an end, Xiao Yang's mind coldly smiled as he observed this demon poison spot. Back then, this thing had tortured him until he had suffered. Now, however, it had become nourishment to raise his strength. Refine. Xiao Yang cried out softly within his heart. Immediately, the jade green flame, surrounding the demon poison spot, suddenly rotated at a high speed. Numerous fire seedlings swarmed over from all directions, like a countless number of fire threads, forcefully cutting the demon poison spot into many portions. Following the separation of the demon poison spot, a thought passed through Xiao Yang's mind and the glazed lotus heart flame was also separated. It wrapped around the many tiny demon poison spots and began to separate and refine them. Xiao Yang's eyes were tightly shut within the room. Wisps of jade green flames slowly rushed out of his skin, gradually increasing the temperature of the room. As more time passed, the poison contained within Xiao Yang's body was gradually turned into nothing under the refinement of the glazed lotus heart flame. After the demon poison spot was refined, the waves of pure Dou Qi hidden within the poison would surge out. After which, they flowed like flood water through Xiao Yang's veins, causing his body, which had originally been exhausted of Dou Qi, to be swiftly filled. His aura was slowly recovering to its peak, with Xiao Yang's current strength, it was not too difficult to refine the demon poison spot. Everything proceeded smoothly and naturally. All he needed was time, time was just like water and one could not afford to squander it. Xiao Yang was unaware that three days had passed during this refinement. Zun Er and the others had come to find him during these three days and found that the tightly shut door was a little strange. 
It was fortunate that they were not reckless people. After sensing the hot air pouring from the room, they could guess that Xiao Yang should be training. Hence, they did not forcefully disturb him, Yi City had become a lively place during Xiao Yang's three days of quiet training. The reason for this liveliness was naturally because of the soul-stirring battle that had occurred a couple of days ago. The appearance of Xiao Yang's group and the place they stayed were all in the Yi clan, causing the Yi clan's recent reputation to be replaced. Many people had thought that the Yi clan had already declined. However, looking at it now, it seemed that there was an extremely powerful patron behind them. It was also because of this that some of those factions with ill intent for the Yi clan did not dare do anything for now. Even the experts from the Ice River Valley ended up leaving in a dispirited manner. There was no need to even talk about them. By relying on the reputation of Xiao Yang's group, the Yi clan had also enjoyed a period of silence. It had been a long time since the Yi clan had enjoyed being the focus of everyone's attention. I have broken through to three stars her, Xiao Yang's tightly shut eyes slowly opened at this moment. There were some traces of a jade green flame flowing within his black eyes. Xiao Yang lowered his head and looked at his chest. The demon poison spot had yet to be completely refined. He was still able to see many small, black-colored spots. The agglomeration of Xie Bai Yang's lifetime of Dou Qi was not a small sum currently, my body is in its best condition. It is really a pity if I give up like this, Xiao Yang looked at the small, black-colored spots. He hesitated for a moment and did not immediately end his training condition. Instead, he once again shut his eyes, directing his mind. Since he had already refined the spots to such a state, he should completely resolve them. However, he wondered if the Dou Qi that remained in the demon poison spot would allow Xiao Yang to advance to a four-star Dou Zone. The remaining demon poison spot was unable to hold out against this refinement by Xiao Yang. Within half a day, the tiny black spots completely disappeared from Xiao Yang's chest. Only at this moment did the demon poison spot, that Xie Bai Yang had planted within Xiao Yang's body, completely vanish. If that old fellow in the underworld came to be aware that his demon poison spot had not only failed to take Xiao Yang's life, but had instead aided the advancement of Xiao Yang's strength, it was likely that he would be extremely furious. After refining the remaining bits of the demon poison spot, the pure Dou Qi that remained flowed through Xiao Yang's body. There might be a great amount of Dou Qi, but it did not reach the point where he showed signs of breaking through to the fourth star of the Dou Zone class. The gap between the levels in the Dou Zone class were extremely large. It was not an easy matter to raise one's strength even if Xiao Yang possessed a training nourishment like the demon poison spot, Xiao Yang nodded only after sensing the surging energy that filled the room. He once again shut his eyes. With the support of this energy, he should be able to successfully reach the level of a four-star Dou Zone. While Xiao Yang was trying his best to raise his strength, over ten black shadows were accompanied by a bloody wind as they flew across the sky over 500 kilometers from Yu City in a wild manner, upon a closer look one would discover that these large black figures were numerous four-winged beasts with a single sharp horn on their heads. Some figures in purple-black clothes were standing on the heads of these single-horned beasts. A vague majestic aura was quietly undulating from their bodies, a man was standing with his hands behind his back on a four-winged single-horned beast right at the front. The man was extremely handsome, but there was a gloomy expression on his face as his eyes stared at the distant northern horizon, Commander Ling Quan, based on the information we have obtained. Young Miss should be in your city in the Pill region, a man in purple-black robes respectfully reported from behind the handsome man. Ling Quan was a familiar name. This person was the commander of the so-called Black Submerged Army, who had a conflict with Xiao Yang back when he had taken Zunna away from the Inner Academy, Ling Quan, that trash from the Xiao clan is also there right? Ling Quan faintly asked. A dark and solemn fury flashed across his eyes. Hearing this, the person behind hesitated for a moment before nodding. Ling Quan was expressionless. His eyes looked to the north while his fist slowly tightened. A ferocious expression flashed across his eyes, little trash. I gave you a warning back then to keep your distance from young miss. Looks like if I do not give you an unforgettable lesson this time around, you will not put this commander's words in your heart. Dense, crimson energy permeated the spacious room. The high temperature spread, causing this room to appear as though it was on fire. Hot air was steaming within it. Xiao Yang sat cross-legged on the bed. His body was just like a bottomless pit, as it continuously absorbed the surrounding bright red energy into his body. Following the entrance of this bright red energy, his skin began to show a crimson color. Perspiration continuously surfaced on his face, 
followed its outline, and dripped down like flowing water. This was the first time that Xiao Yang had directly absorbed the energy within medicinal ingredients. During his previous trainings, he would blend or refine the medicinal ingredients and unleash the energy within the medicinal ingredients to their limits. However, he currently did not have sufficient time. The opportunity to break through would disappear in a flash. He did not know when it would appear again if he were to wait. Part 1 End Here